Okay guys, I'm going to uh, demonstrate for you uh, the timber hitch, which is part of the killick hitch, um, but the timber hitch is the, the first part of that, right? And that's what the Coast Guard requires you to know. So you're gonna take your um, working end and you're gonna come around your log or your object, make sure that it's a rough surface, not something like a slick pipe, steel, plastic, or anything like that, or even like a slick broom handle. So you're gonna bring that working end around the standing part and you're gonna wrap it a minimum of four times around itself, okay? Okay, and now I've tied a timber hitch. You can see that the timber hitch is uh, grippy there, right? You might wanna put it somewhere um, but if I tried to pull on just that, it would pull the log in a, in a cattywampus direction, and we don't want that. We want it to pull straight. So in order to turn this from just the Coast Guard required um, timber hitch, we're going to add two half hitches to it. You simply take that, make your loop around the end here, okay? I'm going to add one half hitch, okay? And then I'm just gonna simply add another half inch to it. Okay, I'll put it right here by this offshoot of this branch here. And now I have what's called a killick hitch, okay? And the killick hitch um, will make the timber hitch the anchor and the two half hitches will be the pulling part. And that is how you make a killick hitch or how you would um, further on with your timber hitch. Pretty simple. Again, I can show you guys one more time how we'll do that. We'll take it apart. Um, and you want to make it like this versus doing it pre-doing it because you might not want to pull all your tow line through if you're towing something. So it's good to learn it in this method. So again, I'm going to take my working and I'm going to place it under the log. I might have to do that in the water. I'm going to come around the standing part of the line right here. And I'm just going to wrap. Four wraps. Minimum of four wraps. Okay. Uh, maybe I got enough in there for three. Um, almost there. But that is going to hold. Then I'm going to take it and I'm going to put half hitches on it. And this will turn it into something different, which is called a killick hitch. Again, if you're going to be using the timber hitch to um, tow something out of the water, you're going to want to make sure that you add the two half inches to it, thus turning it into a killick hitch. Okay. And that's how it should look, folks.